Well, it's 22 hours into the day of uh, June 19th, 2012. It's a Tuesday, and well, I finished earlier today. Around ended up finishing uh, around 8:30 in the morning. Uh, I was going to finish early. I was supposed to finish earlier than that. But something came up. I started working on something. I thought it was going to be small. And it took me an extra two, hour, two hours to get done. And all uh, the rest is kind of, uh, well, it's history now. Anyways, I'm watching my favorite Zoe 101. Catching up on what's going on on YouTube. Uh, what, I, what I'm looking at is that uh, some of the girls out on YouTube, particularly the younger set, uh, they're doing uh, stuff that's so creative. It's actually inspiring. It, it, it pushes you to do more. I mean, it, 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 and it's kind of it's fun to do it like that. It, 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 it makes stuff that you maybe have to do something something later on down the road. You have to get something for uh, for your research, and you're doing the studying, and I'm still doing the studying and doing a lot of the studying. It's a lot, and it really parallels with doing homework and studying uh, for projects in school. But if you have some of the kids to hang around with while you're doing homework, even if you're not really there, but you're virtually hanging out on, on the internet and they're doing homework and you're seeing the stuff that they're playing with, how they're do, working with the LPS and seeing how they come up and create the stories and uh, create the sets, they do all the motions and the figures and everything like that, it helps you give you an environment that you can actually play in and learn at the same time. And that's quite, kind of what I'm doing here is I'm um, uh, sort of uh, overlapping some of the research I need to get done uh, with some of the playing at LPS and uh, the Moxie Girls and, and stuff like that. And so I'm, I'm, having, a, I'm having a lot of fun uh, looking at this stuff. And there are a number of, uh, uh, of uh, YouTubers out there uh, who work right now work on LPS, doing animation with LPS, uh, who uh, really are doing an amazing job and the, the kind, kind of get, they get your... Uh, creative juices flowing, so uh, I'm working on that. Uh, even though it does take a fair bit of time, I, yesterday I spent uh, uh, I think five or six hours uh, working on animating text, getting it to work different ways. So, <laughs> yeah, I have my fun. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to continue on for today. Uh, the day is now starting. I'm going to go through uh, go through the YouTube list uh, while uh, the uh, yesterday's uh, yesterday's uh, the last well, while the next episode of, uh, uh, of Big Bang Big Bang Theory RL is uh, in the editing bay right now is being rendered uh, in about a half hour it will be uploaded so I would say around 11 o'clock I'll start pushing it out to the social media you'll start seeing it on Twitter Facebook uh, Nerd Fighters uh, MySpace and um, high five, you know, the whole, the whole standard area there. Anyway, uh, I'll talk to you in a bit. Well, as you can hear by the chimes, the chimes, it's five hours and two minutes into the day of Wednesday, June 20th, 2012, and we are continuing on. We're not starting the day, we're continuing the day. Uh, from before, uh, although the day has been a, 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 a been a somewhat of a bizarre day, uh, not in the sense that uh, things didn't get done, it's just they didn't get done in the manner that uh, I was expecting them to get done. Uh, what ended up happening today, today ended up being a somewhat of a slow day, 
Uh, although uh, all the work did get done, I made a comment on somebody's channel, and uh, it was more of an uh, of an organization day and reorganization day where. As I was able to more successfully complete certain tasks and uh, sections of projects, uh, I was able to look at the schedule, sort of rearrange things, so that I, I have a uh, uh, a better handle on on, on finishing projects in, in a uh, more timely manner. In other words, uh, I'm looking at improving the efficiency. Uh, the efficiency with which uh, I able, I'm able to complete projects or do particular tasks here. Uh, that sort of in conjunction with uh, uh, taking a little bit of a slowdown uh, so I can uh, recharge, regenerate, uh, sort of deal with some of the sleep deprivation. It's also really, really hot, so uh, the decision is that uh, I probably won't be doing anything between the uh, uh, the hours of noon and 6 p.m. during the day, that's your that's your hottest period. So I will more than likely be taking a uh, uh, time down at that point, uh, just to allow the, the systems here to sort of do their own work and then go from there. Uh, it's uh, it's. Uh, It's a real uh, interesting uh, thing to see how I end up uh, doing what I do. Because it, it, most of the day, really, <laughs> for the large most part of it, is not planned. I don't plan out what I'm going to do during the day. A lot of it sort of falls into uh, existence or falls into play as I complete one task and see what's next to do I'll then pick to see what will come next and it's usually the product that's the most that's either the most ready to be worked on at that particular point in time uh, or that's sort of kind of right in front of me in other words uh, it's the immediacy of the project in terms of the pro or I mean, the proximity of the project that will determine whether I work on it or not. Uh, also, uh, the fatigue level will sort of play into things. Uh, if I've got a new idea that's just coming out, uh, I'll put other projects aside to work on the new idea just to sort of get it into the notebook and give it a place even though I might put it aside for another couple of days. Uh, you know, it, the, the how I do things changes depending on what needs to be done and how important in terms of when the project has to be finished is that I'm actually working on uh, at the time. If the project, I get to a point where it, another work has been sufficiently done and the immediacy of the project falls back, I will bring another project that needs uh, urgent attention uh, that sort of is sort of pressing. I'll bring that project forward and move uh, a project with a lesser immediacy that I've just sort of fixed up and worked on back in the uh, back in the schedule lineup. So that's sort of what's been going on today. Uh, I got some filming done. We'll be doing more filming tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to see if I can sort of bump up the, film, the the amount of filming that I get done. Uh, and that's about it. Uh, I think we're going to be on schedule for either this week or next week to have a new new sections to uh, X plus put in. I'm work on an ending theme plus an an additional uh, for a ten to thirty second spiel at the end. So uh, that will be in addition to the short 10-second uh, uh, free speech free speech flag. So they'll all kind of go together. Anyway, uh, that's about it for now. If I can think of anything, I will come back and say more. Otherwise, uh, it's going to the editor uh, probably sometime around 6 or 7 o'clock in the morning.
Welcome. Welcome to the library. And I am the library. I am the professor. And professor of what? Professor of physics. Free speech rules here at Democratic Earth.